test one, two, three. Test one, two, three. Better fix the length of this cable. What's good everybody? Valley here once again. Welcome back to, this isn't the workbench. It is really snowy outside, so I decided to record the video out here today. And uh, yes, this is the prototype of the MHP Arms Turkey. It is a semi-auto mag-fed fly with the world blaster. And I've got a pair of the Moonlight wheels in mine. And yeah, it is a katana fed, although there is a version that now takes talons as well, but you just stick in there. And a nice feature of this thing is you can pull the slide back and you can take your darts and you can just simply top feed them like so, which is really good for scaven scavenging games and this such. And then you just hit the mag release and there you go. My slide doesn't always like to return fully back because the spring that I have in here is a little bit too long, but um, that is besides the point. But yeah, uh, you might notice that the bottom of my grip is gone, but that is because I do not have a single 3S that is small enough to actually fit in the grip here. I do have one that is able to kind of wedge in there, but yeah. And I really like the way it looks. Mine is sort of in a sort of semi-realistic ish um, color scheme right now because it's the prototype and I just wanted to have it sort of in my uh, the gray that I use for testing but I still have loads of the orange or anything that printed really well and I painted the grip black because I thought that would look nice anyway but yeah it takes a it takes a little bit of getting used to for me because I actually end up getting a lot of short uh, shots because you need to let the wheels rev up with the straight pusher as opposed to a pigeon where you have a little more travel to the pusher before it actually pushes it in after you pull the trigger. And obviously on the ghost pigeon, I have the grip rev system, which allows me to have a separate rev system for it. With this, I just need to lightly pull the trigger a little bit. And that one is a little bit short, but it takes a little bit of getting used to, but overall it's still quite nice. And you're able to swap out barrels, you swap out grips, because everything is sort of all self-contained into the centerpiece here, because the whole body and everything are a bunch of different separate pieces. And putting this together was a little bit annoying because I accidentally ruined a couple micro switches because I accidentally melted them. <laughs> but that's my own fault because I'm an idiot. But yeah! Let me know what you guys think down in the description below. And yeah, thanks for watching. 